Today on Kids Live. Something a little fun than exciting. It's a little cool. Good morning, Kids Live. But before we carry on, let's just pray together. God, I'm going to pray with you as Sanders. Lord Jesus Christ, thank you so much that we can have another Kids Live today. God, I'm going to pray with you as Sanders. We can have another Kids Live today. And Lord Jesus, we pray and ask you to please come and be with us and speak to us. We pray this in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Now, before we carry on, we will first listen to a song. Uchesu tandu mtuano mwane nje inga mi Uchesu tandu mtuano mwane nje inga mi Washale sifubeni, washale matoleni Uchesu tandu mtuano mwane nje inga mi Uchesu tandu mtuano mwane nje inga mi Uchesu tandu mtuano mwane nje inga mi Washale sifubeni, washale matolweni Uchesu tandu mtuano mwane nje inga mi Thank you so much for that beautiful song. Today, I want to tell you a story about bats. Do you know what a bat is? It's something in between a bird and a mouse. It's got the body of a mouse but with the wings of a bird. I don't like bats. But you know, one day in my house, every day when we went to bed, we'd hear in the roof. So we thought, what can it be? It sounds like mice. It's like tap, 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 tap. Scurry, scurry. So one day we thought, no, we have to do something about this. So my dad put a ladder near the roof and he climbed up and opened at the roof. And guess what he found there? Bats! Oh, and we don't like bats. You know how bats can really destroy a home. They make it dirty. It's just terrible. So we thought, what can we do to chase away these bats? I wonder if any of you children have an idea how one can chase away bats. Well, now you've Yes, let me tell you what we did. We decided to put a light in the roof. That's right, a light. Because bats don't like, like it when it's light. They like darkness, like the darkness you find in caves and roofs. Yeah, 
And you know, the next night, we could sleep with no feet scratching on the ceiling. And I can just imagine what happened. No, it's after the day, the bats are coming back to their the night, house at night, and they're flying in and boom! <gasps> There's a light! Let's get out, let's get out, let's get out! And Can you imagine the confusion? They were used to that. This is their house where it's dark the whole time. But now they came and they found the light there. And you know, the interesting thing was, they tried again and again to come, but every time they had to fly away, they couldn't stay there because the light made them uncomfortable. And do you know, children, in our spiritual lives, there are also bats. Those are called sin bats. Like disrespect, self-pity, irritation, or even bad thoughts. And you know, those are sins. You don't go and look for them. They come and they find you. Now children, those are just some examples, but you know what sin it is that has, seems like it's made its home in you. You confess it over and over again, but they just seem to come back. But did you know that sin bats are just like bats in real life? They only like where it's dark. So don't you think we need a light in our hearts as well to chase away these sin bats? So I'm going to read what the Bible says about this light. And we find that in John 8 verse 12. Again, Jesus spoke to them saying, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will not walk in darkness, but will have the light of life. You see, children, if we follow the Lord Jesus, who is the light of the world, then we won't have darkness in our hearts. And as soon as the light of the Lord Jesus shines in our hearts and rules there, these sin bats must fly away. And just like the bats at our house, they might try to come back because our hearts were their home for a long time. But if they find the light of the Lord Jesus still shining in our hearts, you know what? They will have to fly away. So how do we get this light in our hearts? Let's read again what the Bible says. As in Psalm 18, verse 28. There it says, You let my light shine, O Lord my God. 
You lighten my darkness. Ukanyisa ugumnyama kwami. You see children, we must ask the Lord Jesus to shine his light in our hearts and then we must do what it says in John 8 verse 12, we must follow him. Fanele simvumele uNkosi Jesus akhanyisa impilo zethu senze lokho okusho ujohn ujohn 8 verse 12 ukuthi siyenze lokho afuna ukuthi sikwenze thi yena that means walking where the lord jesus walks si si hambe lapho uNkosi Jesus ahamba khona and obeying him futhi simlalele when how can we obey him singamlalela kanjani yena let's just look at one example also in the bible asifunde isibonele sodwa esithulale babelin in 1 john 2 verse 10 to 11 God tells us that whoever loves his brother stays in the light but whoever hates his brother is walking in the darkness. Ngoka Johanna uqala uqala incwadini yokuqala isahluko sesibili iverse ka 10 kuya ke 11 nithi uthi uNkulunkulu lo othanda ohamba ekukhanyeni uthanda umfo wabo kodwa ongahamba ekukhanyeni uyamzonda umfo wabo. So isn't this what the Lord Jesus is telling us that we must love our brothers our sisters those whom we stay with Lokho nje uNkosi Jesus ucena khona ukuthi fanele sithande osisi bethu nobhudu bethu labehlala nabo And this is one way that we stay in the light of the Lord Jesus and keep following him Leo indlela ezingahlala ekukhanyeni kwenkosi Jesus simlandele njalo And you know children the Bible teaches us that love is patient bantwana ibhabeli yasifunda ukuthi uthando luyamekezela love is kind lunomusa futhi uthando love does not envy it doesn't want what other people have and it doesn't boast uthando alifuni alinawo umbona alifunele lokho abanye abantu abanako noma futhi libe nempakamo it's not arrogant and it's not rude ali phakamisi futhi anayi inhliziyo embi it doesn't insist on its own way and it's not irritable or resentful ali qasuki alifuna indlela yalo futhi so if my friend wants to play with a ball but i get upset and i don't want to because i want to play hide and seek Sema umgani nami ufuna yena umdlala ngebhola wena musu yacasuka uthi ngoba phela wena kanti ufuna ukudlala wena uma cashelana Do you think that's love children? Ngicinga ukuthi lolo uthando? Mhm no. Akusile uthando bantwana. Oh what if mommy asks me to the, do the dishes and I sulk because I don't want to do the dishes. Sema umama ucele uthi washizija wena musu yacasuka ngoba phela wena ufuna ukwashizija. Is an Afrikaans word for that it's duck back to have a thick lip. No khoke ngis Afrikaans ube nomlobo mude. Do you think that's love children? Bantwana uthando yini lolo. No. Aksile uthando lolo. Love means serving others and willing to being willing to be the least. Uthando lichaza ukuthi So that is how we stay in the Lord Jesus's life by continuing to serve and love the people he's put in our lives. Ilokho ileyondlela ehlala ekhanya kwenkosi uJesu senze ukuthi uNkulunkulu asebenze empilweni zethu. But children the sad thing is that we can lose the light of the Lord Jesus in our hearts if we are not careful. Bantwana okuhlunga ukuthi singalahlekelwa ukukhanya kwenkosi uJesu uma singaqapheli. When things like disobedience or stubbornness sabe kufungena izinto umhlambe ngonqalaleli noma inkani. Grudges, selfishness or pride amaqubu umona nempakamo and even fear. Hlambe nokwesaba nje. Those are all things that the devil sends to see Will we accept these things and if we accept those things in our life then we take the darkness back into our hearts. Ileso izinto kusathana akayi letha empilweni zethu ufuna ukubona ukuthi sizoyithatha masithatha samkela ubumnyama empilweni zethu. And what happens if it's dark in our hearts? 
I'm sure you can tell me already. All the bats come back and they feel comfortable again in our hearts and make their home in our hearts. And children, if you see that is what has happened in your hearts, you must run quickly to the Lord Jesus and ask him to forgive give you and to shine his light in your heart again. Because the Lord Jesus wants to help you. He wants to shine his light in your heart and chase away all the bats. He's not happy if he sees your life is full of darkness and bats. Because you are his child. And he wants to see his children full of his light shining for him. So let us read again what John 8 verse 12 says. I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will not walk in darkness. But will have the light of life. Children, let us follow the Lord Jesus by loving him and obeying him. Then the bats of sin won't be able to make their homes in our lives. Now, before we listen to the final song, we'll first ask Ms. Waiega to pray for us. Okay. Lord Jesus Christ, we thank you so much for what we have heard. Please help us, Lord Jesus, that we won't stay with bats in our hearts. But that we would always ask for your light. Please be with each and every child that is at home. And we thank you for everything that you have done for us, Lord Jesus. And that which you still continue doing for us. Amen. Amen.